Hello everyone, I hope everybody's doing well. Today I want to share a dream that I had about three to four days ago. In this dream, I saw a Bible. And as I opened the Bible, I noticed that some of the pages had oil. This oil looked like anointing oil. At first, I thought that somebody poured oil on the Bible. But then I noticed that the letters were not coming off. And um, the Bible was intact. Then the dream changed. And I, I saw myself in this church. There was a, a spill of oil on a wood stand. Like where they usually put the Bible when people read it. I started to apply the oil on the wood stand. Like anointing the stand. There was a friendly man standing right beside me. Like a priest. He was watching what I was doing. He said something, but I can't remember exactly what he said. Then I noticed a lady. She was leaving the church. I knew she was one of those people that helped with the cleaning of the church. And as she was leaving, I noticed that she was mad. She said something mean, and she was like, as she said something mean as she was walking out. I cannot remember exactly what she said, but it was something mean. I heard what she said, but I didn't say anything. And I kept on anoint anointing the wood stand. Then the same lady knew that I heard what she said, and she came back, like trying to be nice, but I didn't say anything. Then another lady came over, and she said, I should be cleaning the spill. But then I said, don't worry, I will do it. And then I woke up from the dream. When I woke up from the dream, I was thinking about the message. And the Father gave me understanding that some people help because they think that it's an obligation. These people hate what they do, but they do it because they want to look good in front of others. They want people to say good things about them because they're helping with the church. In Matthew chapter 15, verses 8, it says, these people honor me with their lips, but their hearts are far from me. You know, it's sad because um, some people are very concerned about what other people are going to say about them. And they will do anything, even if they don't like it. So people will talk good about them. But we shouldn't be concerned about what other people are going to say about us. We should be concerned about what God is going to say about us. Because people are not going to save us. People are not going to save us. The only one that can save us is God. Jesus Christ who came and died for the forgiveness of our sins. Do not put your faith in human. Put your faith in God. Another message that the Lord gave me in this dream is that some people are not doing their job in the church. And they are busy doing something else. My advice for you is uh, to read the Word of God, follow the Ten Commandments, and have a personal relationship with God. Do not worry about what people have to say about you. Worry about what God has to say about you. Because He's the one who matters. He's the one who can give us eternal life.